first time at the beach. She's never seen the beach before. I wonder what you're going to make of this, huh? She's so not enthusiastic about it. She's not a beach person. She's like, what are you doing to me? Not a beach person. <laughs> Summer vibes. First day at the beach. You enjoying yourself? Yeah. Yeah. Soaking in the sun rays. Ever reliable. Blah, 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 blah. How are you feeling? <laughs> she doesn't like sand. It's too sandy. It's coarse. Everywhere. This is a lot right now. <laughs> We're having a little bit of a groundbreaking moment, literally. We're playing gently dis at a distance with the sand. Do you think we keep our house too clean? Maybe. <laughs> ah! You got me! See, it's fun. You expect a kid's first day in the sand to be like their first time eating cake. It just ends up all over them and in their mouth. She's getting there. You're digging. I'll make you. I'll make you a house. Yes. Sand in the bucket. Sand in the bucket. Can I make me a house also? I can make you a house also. Ready? And Jay's relaxing. Ready? Sand in the bucket, nice and flat. And put it in the middle of the corridor. Did you hear that? We're getting laughs. We're getting sand laughs. Watch this. Ready? <laughs> So she enjoyed it in the end, not thoroughly, but she to I guess tolerated is probably a better word for it because she wasn't quite tolerating it at first. You loved every second, didn't you? <laughs> yeah. It's dinner time, we're having a bit of a barbecue. Yeah. This looks great. <laughs> Chef Phil, thanks Phil. Oh, <laughs> we're enjoying a little bit of a getaway with our friends Tash and Phil. I guess this is technically Hello. a collab. If we can find a way to do some art and horse riding, I think I don't think we have either we've, already, that. Yep. we've done that, we're just hanging out now. This looks awesome. What's here? We are at the chocolate factory. World of chocolate. Oh my goodness. That's a lot of chocolate. Come with me and you'll be the world. You like chocolate? Yes, you do. You are so right. do I. <laughs> okay, what I need everyone to do is put their hand like that and make a little cup. And so I can drop the chocolate in. Just, uh, sit. Lovely. Perfect. I think that, I think yes, that means you can have it now. <laughs> you can eat it. You sure can. Oh, thank you. There you go. Is that fun, lady? Hi, Jen. Who's that? Who's that? So we're getting a nice pub meal and I've decided I have to try the world famous fish and chips. It's world famous guys. So we're going to find out. I know you've all been wondering what the fish and chips is at the, what's this place called again? San Remo. San Remo Hotel Motel. So I know, I know you've all had questions. Today is the day we finally yeah. find out. Just something to point out that their main is the world famous, but the seniors is, the, is just not the world famous one. They just get like a cheaper average fish and chips. I'm getting the world famous one. Oh, here it is. We got the two, we both got the world famous. This is the world famous fish I think it's world grilled famous with veg. Because it's so big. All right, I have to say, I'm a little concerned that the tartar hit on the watery side. Is it? I like a chunkier. You're a tartar connoisseur. I remember. <laughs> and the success of the world famous will depend on the tartar. But it's world famous fish and chips, not world famous fish and chips. It didn't say that the tartar is big. It's got a crisp, 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 crisp. Are you guys finish your food with your neck and I eat my food? <laughs> this is the <laughs> It's a bit of a rainy, windy day and the kids have decided it's a great idea to go out for an adventure into neighbouring properties. They're all, 
<laughs> They're on a construction site exploring the landscape. Oh, have you got pants on? He's just out there in his jumps. That's my boy. <laughs> Not too breezy for you. <laughs> We're off on an adventure. Tash, Tash, I feel like we need to clear the air on something. Okay. Because when we collabed, there were a lot of comments who that were really upset on your behalf that I cut Arba's hair. I feel like we need to roll that, that right now. Know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll roll right now, guys. This is what happened. So just from the back. Yeah, couple, yeah, yeah. Couple, couple of inches. inches. Perfect. All right, so I've grabbed a couple of inches. That is so awkward. I met a couple of inches from the bottom. Oh, from the end? So your Frisian gorgeous stallion that you've had for ages and has been with you through Yes, my, my best friend. His hair has never been cut. No. And I did that. Yes. So how did you actually feel? Because you agreed to it. It wasn't like I well, did I that remember, without you knowing. I remember when we first met, you, 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 you flipped it in there at the end, like, oh, you know, we could do something. Maybe I'm thinking something with the arbor. Yeah. And I was like, oh, yes, that would be fabulous. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't quite know what, what you were thinking. And then you said a little bit of hair. And then you did say, yeah, I'm thinking we this. Cut off a, and I went, yeah. thank God he's old. Like he has lived okay. a full life. If he was 10 you years did like younger, you computed it. You're like, yeah. okay, this is a big ask. But we can, I could do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it was for a good cause. Yeah. I don't know what the cause was. Oh, yeah. Great, great content. That's, right. <laughs> That's always a good cause. But yeah, yeah, people were like, there were some people who were very angry. Very they angry. They were like, I can't believe he did that without asking. He should understand that, blah, blah, blah. It was always part of the place. She was in on yes, it. But I, I think it still probably hurt a little bit. So. Yeah, well, but I would've, it would have hurt more if it was my own hair. It hasn't hurt you enough that we can't hang out and be friends after, so that's, that's good. <laughs> All great friendships are born on the Through like the that. <laughs> through the trials, yes. that's it. Where are they now? Are they that, that's them, okay. Oh my goodness. They're chasing these birds. Okay. That's so cute. Oh no. Has he ever climbed a fence before? <laughs> Look at him. He's just them, championing them. Go, go, go. He I don't think he's ever climbed a fence before. It's <laughs> <laughs> always a first time. Here it is. And he's the last one too. <laughs> they can catch him if you make the last one. Okay. He really should have gone in the middle. One third encourage yeah. him not to push. Come on, you can do it. This is a lot. This is high pressure for the poor guy. Come on, Brad. You can do it. It's a bit, it's almost twice as high. I think you're saying you go and I'll wait. <laughs> you're doing great, guys. Your kids are just like, well, are you coming or not? <laughs> I love it. I love watching them work it out. <laughs> no man shall be left behind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they did it! Yay! Hey! <laughs> Whoa! Aren't they going to go back in there to get the birds? I think, I think she said it's a new plan. I feel like they're heading to the ice cream shop. <laughs> oh, the kangaroos. Oh, there's 10 oh. kangaroos. Oh, no way! I know, I'm really glad the oh, kangaroos are going the other way. way. Look at oh, that! Look Whoa! That's so cool, there's heaps. Don't pick a fight! <laughs> You're, a, I'm getting this Darwinian sense from you, Tash. If they come back alive, they've, they've won the game. <laughs> oh my god. Our children are out there alone, surrounded by kangaroos. I don't think this is our greatest parenting moment. Whatever happened to the birds? I think the birds are still here, guys. Don't keep running away! They're still going. They're still going. Shouldn't we go and get them? Yeah, I think at this point. <laughs> All right, Phil's the real MVP. He's <laughs> gone out and rallied them back in. <laughs> and we're back. <laughs> you guys went pretty far. Oh my goodness. You went so far away. Did you see the kangaroos? Yep, but they ran away. They ran away. They ran away. There was a daddy one which wanted to punch you. Really? How close did it get? It's not moving off the hill. Really? It was, was standing on the hill just looking at him, yeah. Oh, wait, How close? Oh, he did trample oh, to the first umbrella here, maybe a little bit further. Yeah. No way! Did you do the like this? Are you serious? <laughs> Had his gloves on and everything. So there you go, that was just a little bit of a family holiday. Hope you guys have enjoyed uh, coming along for, it's very bitsy, I haven't been able to show much, but now that I'm back, looking forward to getting back to work. I wonder what the guys have been up to while I've been away. Yeah, here at Jazza Studios, we do what we want. The boss is away and it's time to play. Hey, Jeremy, it's time to spit that shit.
Let's go! Cleaning up the studio, editing a video, backing up the footage, jumping on a trampoline, Facebook Messenger, deleting all the footage. This is what we do when the boss is away. Extremely long toilet breaks, take a nap inside a box, leaving work early, got to work late, steal all the toilet paper, set the studio on fire. Wait, studio on the fire? This is what we do when the boss is away! That was a bit much. <laughs>